Yo, what's going on guys? Makan here. And real quickly, I'd like to apologize for my upload schedule. Um, when I updated OBS, it deleted all my scenes and my settings and whatnot, so I just really couldn't have been bothered to redo them all. But recently I just decided to buckle down, get the settings back, and yeah, I'm here recording now. So, on to the video. So my last parkour video did very well, and some of you guys actually suggested some servers that you like to play on. So today I'll be playing your servers, and I'll be judging those servers based on three things. First, the aesthetic, which is like how like the server is built and how like nice the server looks overall. Two, I'll be uh, judging the community, like how the chat is and how like nice the server is and like how many players are on and whatnot. And finally, I'll be basing this final judgment on the actual parkour. How does the parkour play? Is it fun to play or is it kind of just the same repetitive stuff over and over and over again? So let's get right into it. All right, so the first server comes from I like watching videos and it is gonna be Minehut. So after wandering around the spawn for a little bit, I was actually genuinely impressed with the build team of Minehut. All the builds that they worked on definitely took a long time as they were very large scaled and they were also highly detailed. I think I'm going to rate the build slash aesthetic of the server an 8 out of 10. Unfortunately, after the large scale builds that were very impressive, the server kind of went downhill for me. Um, the chat was completely littered with ads and other questionable comments. And I felt like a lot of times um, the server was a little bit laggy. Um, maybe it's perhaps because of the server size and it looked like the server was being overloaded with way too many players. but. My FPS, which I normally get enough of, definitely took a large hit. So based off the community, I want to give it a 4 out of 10. And finally, we come to the parkour rating. The parkour, I felt, was actually really fun, but the one thing that ruined it was it kept on lagging me back. No matter what version of the game I played in, I played 1.7, 1.8, 1.12, 1.16, .1 and 1.17, and yet, none of them worked. I got lagged back pretty much every single time, but the worst one was in 1.8, because I couldn't even climb up ladders. I believe my best time with all the lagging back was a 1 minute and 56 second time. But I'm pretty sure if I cut out all the lagging out parts and compiled a split run, I believe I could definitely get on the leaderboard. So pretty much if I had an actual like good no lagback time, I would have gone in a 1 minute and 26 second run, which would have been 7th on the leaderboard, so that's why I just can't find Minehut very enjoyable to play. Overall, I'd give Minehut a final rating of 14 out of 30. So the next server comes from Miner, and it's actually Zero Miner. Although personally Zero Miner's build style isn't really my type, I had to give them respect where respect was due. The spawn is very large and open, and I could tell that it must have taken them a long time to have built it. 
Also, each parkour map had a lot of intricate details which I also appreciated. My only complaint was that the room in which you would choose a parkour levels was like really cramped, which kind of detracted from the total score. But overall, I would give Zero Miner a 7 out of 10 on the build aspect of the server. So while I was on the server, it seemed that there was a small community that's still active. The chat was nice, and I didn't really feel uncomfortable, which really made me feel welcome. And because there was nothing really else to say, I'll give the community aspect a 9 out of 10, just because there isn't too many people. So first of all, without any doubts, the parkour is a 10 out of 10. I don't really say this for many servers, but man, I actually really enjoyed the parkour. There's a bunch of levels of all difficulties for all players, and every single level even had a leaderboard ranking for speedrunning. The only thing that's a bit unfortunate is that the server is ran on 1.17, and that comes from me being a 1.8 player. However, that doesn't affect the fact that the gameplay is still incredibly fun. 10 out of 10, I would really, really recommend you to go to Zero Miner. So with all said and done, I would give Zero Miner a 26 out of 30. It's not my favorite parkour server of all time, but man, it was super, super close. Highly recommend, go check them out. Alright, so the third and final server comes from Chips. He suggested a lot of servers, but the one I picked was Jumpcraft, just because I was the most familiar and I've seen it in other chats. So the building on the server was incredibly high tier. It's actually one of the best looking servers I've seen in a really long time. I just thought it was really really good and I have no complaints about it so I'd have to give this a 10 out of 10. To be honest, it's kind of hard to truly understand the extent of the community but from what I saw as an initial reaction to the server, the community seemed pretty small which I don't honestly mind but it seemed like a small tight knit server that's very dedicated to parkour so I'd just give it an 8 out of 10 just for size. And finally the parkour rating. I actually really enjoyed the parkour, it's a 10 out of 10, I had a lot of fun on it, it has a ton of levels for people of all calibers, and it even has a really really good rank up system. Also, there is a timer, so if you want to try and beat your times or speedrun against others, you can do that too. Overall, super fun server, super good parkour. Alright, with all said and done, we have finally played through all three of the servers that you guys suggested. If you have any more recommendations or servers you'd like me to play on, leave it down in the comments. And now, we go into final rankings. Before I get into the rankings, please remember that these are all my opinions, and you guys can have your own opinions, so please don't come after me. Alright, so in third place, we had Minehut, with a 14 out of 30. I think it'd be fun to play, but it's not the best in my opinion. Next, we have Zero Miner. I thought it was a very, very fun server with a very good community, and I gave it a 26 out of 30. And then, in number one, our final server was Jumpcraft, with a staggering 28 out of 30 coming in first place. Remember, I recommend all servers, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe. There's a very small percentage of people who are subscribed, so if you enjoyed my content and you want more, then check it out please. Alright, have a great rest of your day, and peace.